Hi, my name is Miss Bauman, one of the music teachers from Rudy Hill High School, along with Miss Nguyen and Mr Diaz. In this video, we will give a snapshot of the work we have done as the Rudy Hill High School music team in the past three years where we focused on the signature pedagogies of our subject and how that looked in context here at Rudy Hill High School. In this video, we will present our school context, our idea of the music apprentice, the projects we developed and the impact that it had on student learning. Our school context. In the past three years, between 2018 to 2020, we had 42 Year 12 students who completed the Music 1 course. Out of the 42 music students, only four students received formal paid private music tuition. The rest of our students were either self-taught, learning from books or the internet, and others learnt their instrument through a family member, a friend, at church or at school. Our music students average an overall mark of 65% in their HSC exams. Our students range in musical skills, knowledge and interests. We have three music teachers that come from different backgrounds, each having a unique philosophy of how musicians should be trained. In summary, we have a classically trained musician with years of experience playing in orchestras, a jazz musician who loves improvisation, and a singer slash music producer who has a passion for choir and music production. Music Apprentice As we embarked on our journey as a music team to discover our signature pedagogy, we explored, examined and reflected on our lenses. These lenses being school lens, subject lens, faculty lens and our personal lenses. We worked backwards and asked ourselves, what does a 19 year old musician look like? And how do we get students there in our context? And we came up with our charter statement. Our signature pedagogy is the music apprentice, meaning that as musicians, we are all music apprentices with the potential to always grow and move forward in our music journey. We believe that a musician will learn most in their context and at the specific level and passion. They will learn it from a master apprentice where a master apprentice can be a school teacher, private tutor, a family member, another student ahead of the journey, a friend or even a virtual teacher from the internet. And that the apprenticeship is a lifelong process where you may change master apprentices, but the learning never stops. Students come from different backgrounds with different tastes and interests in music. We believe that the music classroom should not be limited to the physical classroom. As music teachers, we wanted to create and embed in our programs, spaces and projects where musicians can grow and move forward in their journey as music apprentices. As a music team, we launched a variety of projects. The three we will focus on today are the three key strategies we implemented for the Year 12 Music Class of 2020, which we implemented from 2018 when the students were in Year 10. Number one, performance. We believe that a musician performs in real life events. And so we embedded lunch concerts into our programs where we required all students to perform regularly during lunch concerts. We developed lessons inspired by Bill Lucas to work on tenacity, but also gave students agency to workshop and produce their performance where they learnt their pieces and rehearsed in their own time at home or during breaks. We aimed for students to improve all aspects of the HSC performance criteria. So we created a performance scaffold for a way for students to self-reflect, give peer feedback, and also as a talking point to receive teacher feedback. 
Number two, composition. We believe that musicians are composers who compose using traditional methods and also current technology. We believe that composers and producers should have access, space, time, and most importantly, an opportunity to collaborate and receive feedback. So we dedicated space and resources to developing a recording studio for music students to be creative in their own time and at their own pace. Students were able to collaborate with both teachers and students and receive quality feedback. Number three, musicology. We believe that musicians know and value their music theory in the context. We believe that musicians learn best when music lessons are targeted for their specific level and taste, and they understand the purpose of what and why they are learning and they see the fruits of their labour. So as a music team, we created a Rudy Hill High School specific website. This website caters for different instruments, genres and levels, targeting the musical experience of performance, composition and musicology, as well as the concepts of music. Lessons are broken down into levels and are designed as short cycle formative assessments, where we developed tutorial videos for music students to learn a specific skill and musical theory. And then they are assessed before they move on to the next level. Teachers are able to use websites as a whole class activity or to cater for advanced students or for students who need improvement in a certain area. To improve their understanding of musical concepts and improve their oral skills responses we developed Google Slides that students can access in their own time and at their own pace, with specific definitions and musical examples, and checkpoints to assess their understanding where they can receive instant feedback. As a music team, we believe that musicians need to present their work and need to have an audience. So we required all music students to develop their own musician website where they uploaded their performances and compositions. Other music elective students can then give them feedback through an attached Google form. In the past three years, we asked music students who performed at lunch concerts to reflect and fill out a survey to examine their improvement against the music performance criteria and also to see if their confidence and engagement have improved. We asked students to rate themselves before and after. Students answered privately and honestly and the results showed the following. Technical skills. Before the survey, 45% and after the survey, 66%. Performance awareness and expression. Before the survey, 47%. After the survey, 64%. Ensemble awareness. Before the survey, 58%. And then after the survey, 70%. Confidence and comfortability. Before the survey, 47%. After the survey, 72%. Engagement, 
The 20 Year 12 music students in the 2020 class all received band 4 and above with an average mark of 76.15%, which was a significant achievement because as a group they averaged 65.72% in their overall HSC exam mark. The students stated that they were HSC ready and most importantly, that they all traveled a long way in their musical journey with a positive and engaging experience that they will all cherish. A musician is a music student. Musicians are lifelong music apprentices, all at different stages of their unique journey. While learning from a variety of master apprentices, as music teachers, our job is to travel with them in that unique journey.